we're leaving home ball. Humboldt, located along the Redwood Coast in Northern California, is one of the most beautiful regions in the West. From our giant redwoods, our wide open beaches, our state and national parks, and our world class fishery. So hang with me, and I'll show you why my family and I live in Humboldt. King Salmon, it's a small fishing community right on Humboldt Bay, it's about five or so miles south of Eureka. There's a little beach access area that faces the north and south jetty and maybe go walk the marina. So I got my partner with me, he's ready, <laughs> I'm ready. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, I appreciate you watching, I'll see you out there. Salmon is such a cool little community, little fishing community. Come on, bud. It's a beautiful day. I mean, it's breezy, but it's got to be, I don't know, if I had a guess, 60, 65 degrees. The nice breeze. What'd you find, bud? Spider-Man. See all King Salmon back in here, all little. It's a cool little fishing village. No slipping trips. You okay, bud? You getting rock climbing on? It's a clear day. Oh, it's breezy. 
Eureka back in there. You can see the pulp mill. Here's the U.S. Coast Guard building. North and South Jetty. Oh, that seat, that uh, breeze feels good. Worse in the winter time, it gets, you know, it's just living on the coast. Spray goes all the way out. And them swells come in, well, you can see right out to the ocean right there. When the swells are coming in from the northwest, they come straight in right here. They come straight into where we're hitting right now, and so they put these rock walls up, help prevent it. Getting all the way up into the community there. 101's right, only oh, we just came in on it. 101's right, one's right along, that's Humboldt Hill in the background. Come on, bud. What a cool little community, look at that. That's the way to the tsunami evacuation point. Do good luck. I'll give you some tsunami safety tips. If you hear them horns run like hell, because <laughs> there ain't only one road out of here and it's that way. You know what I'm saying? There's my turn. Yo, Johnny's at the beach. All right, bud. I think I'm gonna leave him on this one. I'm just gonna go walk out real quick and check it out. sign in front of that Johnny, or a picture in front of that Johnny sign holding a big old halibut. My best friend took me out on his boat. Oh yeah. Had to bend 40, 50 pounds. Man, that's good eating. I'm not going to go out there because we don't really belong. But no slips. That's it. That old spruce tree hanging out there, and there's one there too. We're in a slip. We're in an RV spot. We're coming through, looking for somewhere to 
you got an RV, stay right in King Salmon. All right, I'm going to head over to Phil's Landing real quick and call it a day. All right, King Salmon. It's a cool little fishing community. These RVs in here. There's people watching me back there. Whatever. I don't know if they know what I'm up to or not. I'm just sharing the community, that's all. If you've got a big RV, you're staying in Eureka, come out to King Salmon. I mean, they got big fifth wheels out here. I don't know what the prices are. The bay is right in front of us. Little Gills by the Bay restaurant in the marina. Come out and just chill. If you're on this end anyways, there's the Kenmar RV park down in Fortuna. I've stayed there before. And, and then if you're really going up North County, you can go out to Stone Lagoon out there. There's a really nice one out there. I put it in another video when I did Stone Lagoon, the Elk River or the uh, Elk Country RV spot. Man, that one's really nice. It's north, but it's, it's worth it. All right, I'm gonna drive back through here. back out to 101 and I want to go hit Fields Landing real quick. I'm just going to go out to the, uh, the boat launch and walk it real quick. Let this guy walk one more time and then uh, head home. Here we go. Fields Landing is just a little uh, community right on Humboldt Bay. And, uh, I'm gonna drive through it real quick and go out to the boat launch and walk around a little bit. These railroad tracks, well, they used to, they don't cross here now, but you can see the crossings. Part of the old rail system that used to run down 101 during the logging, logging days, but it's, you know, long been out of service. But you can still see remnants of it all the way through Eureka, the 50 mile corridor up through Arcata. You can see the tracks. I used to be out there. All right. I'm going to find somewhere to park real quick and let this guy walk. You going to walk out a little bit, bud? Yeah. <laughs> it's all kinds of stuff to pee on around here, huh? Come here, buddy. Come on. Don't run off. I, hey, hey, hey. Come here. It's pretty windy, actually. You can see the... Well, there's King Salmon right over there. That's where we were just a minute ago. The breeze feels good, but... Boy, it started whipping up. And over here... You, Kind of see the docks on the other side and those are these old piers. Table Bluff out there. I don't know where the old whaling station is, but somewhere up in here got to stinking, so it didn't last very long, I guess. Come on, bud. Yeah, I don't want you getting in that water, huh? walk out on the dock. Walk at the end of the dock real quick. Call it a day. You don't get visited by those big old dogs again. I see these old dogs. I mean, uh, pardon me, dogs. Walk out the end of this one. The old boat launch. Come on, bud. Come on, come on, they don't want nothing to do with you. Come on.
seaweed floating in, kelp, whatever it is. Breeze feels good. I don't know if the sound is on the camera, but it feels nice. There's a North and South Jetty over there. That's all a king salmon. These old docks. This is the southern spit. Runs up over to Table Bluff right there. The old Table Bluff lighthouse was. Here's the old docks here. Oop. See all these old piers in the water still. Those are old. Anyway. Field's landing, huh? Alright, bud. You ready to go home? Feels by the bay made me hungry. I'll go home and see what my wife has cooking up. There's 101 right behind us, right there. Alright, let's head back to the truck. You ready to go, bud? Alright, let's do it. Get a little short stop at the landing plumber. Ready to go home? <laughs> let's do it. There's somebody running a power saw over there. That's music to my ears. You ready to go, bud? <laughs> He's done. I'm done. That was King Salmon and Fields Landing. Cool little spots. Thank you for watching. I'm Doc, and we're living humble. Well, good night. You made it to the end of the video. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe so we can grow this channel. Also, I'm out at Black Sands Beach near Petrolia. It is beautiful out here. I'll see you on the next one.